Here's what I hope is going to be a short demo showing you how to auto mount network shares in OS X. What you need to do first is actually go in the finder and once in the finder you can find you can click your network neighborhood icon and click the desired location and take note as you go here as you can see I'm under Maison NAS and click on the connect button this will give you a list of all the network shares available in this and as you can see in mine I've got download Alex Bernard mp3 photo and share so take note on a piece of paper of the following information take notes of the share names and also take note of the network server name which in my case is NAS so with this information in mind we are now ready to go to the next step which is the automation of the mounting of those network drives so let's close down the folder and let's call a quick program called automator so to do that the easiest way is to actually hit the apple or command spacebar and, uh, and type automator I, I a u t o and as you can see it shows up right here so i'm going to start automator from the list and here it is uh, the screen is a little bit larger in my capture but i don't want to capture too much so it remains visible so essentially what you're going to do first you're going to click on the finder icon in the screen and the next thing you're going to have to do is click on get specific server and you'll actually click and drag this into the drag or add action section of the folder and drop it there now you see we have this get specified server capture box first thing you want to do is click on the plus sign to actually add a new location you may actually have the screen looking something like this under a capture server that's the default view now I would rather have uh, the view where I can type so it's actually a little bit more concise and easier for you to look at so let's assume you had nothing showing up in the address bar I did add something because I did a few tests obviously before preparing for this tutorial so what you will have to do is type smb column slash slash you'll have to type then the serve the server name you want to mount the files from which in my case is NAS as you had seen before and then you'll need to add the first share name so let's add the mp3 share name so simply hit enter and it will be added to the list of specified servers now go ahead and add the rest of the servers shares you want to mount so in my case I want to mount as well the photo share and I want to mount the download share so let's I'll keep adding to it so I'll add photo and then I'll just replace that and add share here you go so now I've got the three uh, network shares I want to mount the last thing you need to do is go back and you'll see something called connect to servers just simply drag this option under the first section so that the essentially the action will be get specified servers and then connect to servers before you save or try to automate this click the run button to execute the script and make sure that the drives automat automatically mount as you can see mp3 now is mounted then photo then download or share in my case um, so now that I know that I'm able to mount those three network shares we'll, we'll go to the next step which is to actually save this automator script as a workflow file and we're going to call that mount net shares okay and I'll 
click save that's the first thing I'm gonna do and I'm gonna go again and do a file save as and this time I'm not gonna save it as a workflow which is what you're gonna use if you wanted to modify the uh, network shares you're auto mounting I'm gonna actually use uh, application file format so we can actually execute it and I'm gonna keep the same name mount network shares and I'm gonna click save now that this is done we we have an executable file and we can close the mount network share and I'm gonna go under the system preferences and under system preferences you're gonna go and select system accounts this is how we're actually gonna automate the auto mounting of the network shares as you log in in the system so if, as you can see that's my account so I'm gonna click the little lock screen type in my password to give me access to the to my account and I'm gonna click login items and I'm gonna add a new login item that will get executed whenever I log in and in this case I'm gonna click upload documents and I'm gonna go and pick the little mount net shares that's gonna be the 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 one with the icon of a little robot uh, that has a little pen in its end so just pick that click add and now you're done you can just go and close the account window and the next time you log into your account the network shares will auto mount for you and you won't have to mount them manually so you'll end up with something that looks like this I hope this was informational and don't hesitate to give me feedback if you like the tutorial and if you liked it don't hesitate either to click on the links uh, on the website uh, that brings me a few cents every time and that shows your appreciation to the tutorials thank you